What's going on everyone? I Monkey here, the gaming channel all about gaming and improving. In this video, we are going over everything you need to know about positioning, rotations, and decision making, which all go hand in hand with each other. But before we get into it, I'm doing a $100 gift card giveaway for you guys. You get to choose either a PS4 or Xbox gift card. Either one if you win, but it's only one of the two console gift cards. The rules are in the description below, but to go over them briefly, you have to be a subscriber. So if you're not, be sure to subscribe, like this video, follow me on my Instagram so I can DM you your prize if you win. And comment down below what legend you're maining right now. I will draw the winner this Saturday on April 24th, so be ready because $100 is like 11,500 Apex coins, but you can go crazy with that. All right, now getting into why you guys are here. Positioning and rotations are everything when it comes to winning games in Apex Legends. In order to do them correctly, you need to know how to make smart decisions. Making smart decisions comes from experience, learning from your mistakes, as well as learning from others. And I've made plenty. There are some fights you are able to take, and there are some that you're not. Knowing the difference is what determines whether you're going to win or lose the game. There are so many outcomes from the decisions that you make, and since this video is focused on positioning and rotations, I'm only going to be speaking on those. The moment the game starts is the moment you should be deciding where you and your team is going to drop. It's best to drop somewhere on the edge of the map, preferably where a survey beacon is at so you can scan the map as soon as possible to figure out your rotation. And when in rank, it's good to be somewhere near teams so when they begin to fight, you and your team can go in and third party. Be sure to listen to what guns they are shooting and pay attention to the kill feed. When you see a couple go down, that's when you move in to clean up and get early KP. Afterwards, loot fast and rotate to next zone. When rotating to next zone, you want to rotate to the nearest edge of the zone to prevent another fight or rotate to the nearest survey beacon in zone so you're able to scan again. When it comes to positioning, you want to make sure you can find and hold high ground. If there's a team holding high ground already, then this is a moment you and your team needs to decide whether you can or can't take high ground from them. Be aware of your surroundings. This is why it's important to see where people drop because you can have a good guess if another team is nearby. If no one else is nearby and you know that enemy team on high ground is going to be a problem, especially if they are keeping you from rotating in next zone, you need to take that fight. The best way to do that is to not get noticed. Catch one off guard and team shoot him to knock him down. This is when you full send because it's a 2v3 situation. Give them everything you got. But if you're already in the next ring and the enemy team has a great position you can't push on and you believe there's another enemy team nearby, hold your position. Sometimes high ground isn't always the position to take. I've won games being on low ground because I was in the ring and allowed the enemies to focus on each other, especially the team on high ground. Now when you make it to mid to late game and you're not able to hit the survey beacon, this is when things get interesting. Based on how the game is going overall, you need to decide whether you continue to play the edge of the ring or try to take the center. The center is great because you have a better chance of being in the next ring, but it's also the spot that gets mostly focused on. The edge of the ring is great because you're less likely to get focused on compared to the center, but enemies are more likely to kill you and your team when it's time to rotate again. When it comes to late game, making the decision whether you take the center or hang on to the edge comes down to the team composition you're rocking. If the center has high ground and cover and your team has a legend that can hold down an area, then you have a better chance at holding the center. If the center is already taken and there's not much cover, it's probably best to hold the edge. And if you're that team on the edge, try to focus that team that's holding a position you need to take for the next rotation. But be strategic about it. Catch them off guard. If you start shooting them too soon or too late, they will have the advantage on your team while you're trying to rotate in. I believe I covered everything I can about positioning and rotations. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. I'll answer to the best of my ability. And now watch the rest of this gameplay to see how I play and rank. You might learn something, you might not. But enjoy the video.
Pathfinder is almost cracked. He has blue armor. Knocked to the lifeline. Pushing. Got him. Oh, more, 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 more. Body swapping. Oh, what the fuck? Yeah. 27 on red on uh, a cracker. She keeps body swapping. She had like 30 body swaps. Sticking. All I have is a P2020 and charge rifle. Nice purple. He's gonna be one. Nice. She's like one. Yeah, she's dead. Just off, be careful. In here, there's a guy in here. He doesn't know we're back Maybe here though. We can laser him at the same time. Uh, well, there that goes. Do have any purple on him? Should stop playing yeah, They're dipping. Stop playing with him. <laughs> yeah, I like, we can laser from the back and scan. <laughs> find us, find us, find us. I think there's more inside. I think there's more inside. Yeah, more inside. I got your knock. Popping a bat, popping a bat. I cracked the octane. They're split, bro. They're split. They're split. Push, 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 push. They're split. Yeah, yeah. One's knocked and one's low. Cracked them. Hit them for 50 flesh. They're gone. They're gone. Don't, don't aggress. Don't aggress. Don't aggress. There's, there's like 50 teams here, bro. Back here. Oh, shit. Mag sucks. Dumb. I'm, I'm just giving y'all a jump pad. You just saved my life. Hold this, hold this, hold this, hold this. We gotta hold this. They're pushing, they're pushing. Got one. Nice. I gotta jump pad out, or I'm dead. Oh, charge rifle. Yeah. Right, right, right. Oh, I was one shot. Nice. Oh my god. Monster. Shit. No beds. Body swapping. Yeah. Do you do you have a knockdown? I mean a respawn? No. Oh yeah 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 yeah, I got one. They're coming up over here on me east. Yeah, one hundred percent. I'll cover. No, no, they're not pushing. We're good, we're good, we're good. Yeah, we're chilling. We're going positive this game, boys. Time to check this box. Oh! Of course, they picked me last second. I threw that. They were distracted on the other team, and then they just so happened to peek over at me. I threw that. I thought I had time. I needed a bats and stuff. That's my bad. Uh, there's no. Hang on, maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I'm sorry again, I really needed heals. Like big heals. Oh shit, this sucks. Where's the other team at? Got around the odds of it. Zigzag. Got position, we got position. Yeah, just hold under. No one can commit. Not too much. Alright, so it. here's what we could do. We could either risk it, if because I know you're saying jump and then take it to take the fight. Oh yeah, yeah. Hang on, hang on. Actually, yeah, yeah. If they knock someone, use the bubbles. Use the bubbles. Yeah, hang on. They might knock. If they knock two, yeah, I got hills. We can play it down here, honestly. The thing is, though, is with the heat shields, though, they almost go down instantly. Yeah, y'all are gonna have to get them out. Hold him. I might have to throw it at the same time, that way, uh... Not a, well, yeah, basically at the same time. Yeah. Put it down here. The force people go down here. It, it's right here, where I'm standing. That's where it's gonna pull yeah, at. Yeah, I wanna force people to come down here. They're nah, that's not, that's not the play. No, nah, I was gonna say, we could probably... No, y'all should've, y'all should've just stayed with it here. You should've just stayed here. You don't. You you just have to. That you wasted one of y'all's bubble. Y'all have to just play bubbles the small ring. Yeah, bubble the small ring. You don't wasted one though. Okay, that might bubble. lose it because they have three and they could all have bubbles. They're not that uncommon. And that way, just put it. Up. You might actually try it. Drop here soon. Let's. Yeah, it goes immediately.